so in today's video we will be learning about html tables okay <coughs> html tables a table is in html consists of table cells in table cells inside there will be a row and columns okay now table cell each table cell is defined by td tag and a slash td tag to end okay td stands for table data table data everything between td and td slash that is the starting tag and the ending tag for table data are the content of the table cell are the content of the table cell everything between td and slash td okay table rows table rows in each uh, table row uh, sorry each table row stands with tr and ends with slash tr tag and tr stands for simple table row okay you can have as many as row as you like in a table just make sure that the number of cells are the same in each row okay this is all about html rows now html table headers sometime uh, you want your cell to be a header that means you want to define that uh, this row will contain this cell um, this cell will contain this column will contain these things okay so sometime you want to define the header for the table so we will be using the table header in those case use th table header tag instead of td tag instead of uh, table data we will be using th table head tag th stands for table headers by default the tags in th element are bold and centered but you can change uh, that with the css with the style tag okay so this is the chapter summary which we will going to see after uh, the vs code okay so this was our previous uh, previous file for this i will be making uh, another file that is table dot html okay table dot html okay so uh, for table uh, we use table tag okay starting and ending now first we'll defining one table row which is or your tr okay table row inside the table row first i wanted to give the headers okay first i wanted to give the headers okay so my first table header will be i'm making a, a table in which i'll take the um, person 1 person 2 person 3 three persons and i will be uh, taking their email and different different things okay we'll see so first table head i want a uh, pers1 person 1 okay i got a person 1 okay i'll be doing so it will be more clear okay that this is my first table head header okay so that's first table header th second it will be person two and next th person three okay i have taken the three person so this will be my first table row and my second table row table row i will be taking first table data will be td now i am taking the table data okay so first table data uh, will be i'll be taking for example emails okay email okay email now what would i take what would i take i'll just take okay and other thing i will okay that's my second row and in third row i will be taking uh, some numbers 16 table data will be 14 or uh, table data will be what table data i want i want 10 
okay so in this table what we i have taken i have taken three table headers table headers okay and uh, i have taken two rows in which i have taken table data okay i'll just uh, save this and we will be going go live okay okay so are you able to see my table person 1 person 2 person 3 are in bold because i defined them table headers so they are in bold and they are in center okay and this is the email and everything in my table okay now we will be styling this table little bit okay i will be giving some borders and everything around it so now it's time to apply some style to our table okay so we will be using style tag style now as you can see there are so many options so first apply border okay border will be how much i would say two pixel border solid solid and black okay and uh, let's just give it width with how much width i would say 50% width okay so okay 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 wait 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 this comma is for this width how much width i would say 50% width okay so there is this one problem that i have defined this bordering table so this border will be only around the table not for the table row okay you will see i'll save it and i'll open it are you able to see this border is only around the table it's not here here and here not in table rows and in the columns so uh, what we will be doing we will be using your css a little bit okay which we have already discussed okay so i will be using your style okay your style okay style okay so in style i would give this style for everything for table yes for table for table head and for table data everything okay and i want border around everything so i will be given the uh, border is equals to two pixel of border uh, which would be solid and which would be black in color okay and i will be removing uh, i want the width okay width is okay i want the width but i don't want this thing okay we'll save it and we'll see the changes now are you able to see are you able to see the border around every table head border border around every table data so this is the style tag this is the css which give the style to our ht uh, to our website okay so this was all about for table okay we will see the summary of the table a uh, summary of this video okay so this is uh, the chapter summary for today's video yes so these are the tags and this is the description your table tag is def uh, it define the table your th table header define the header of the cell in the table tr table row define the row in the table td define the cell in the table there are so many okay you can define the column as well you can define the t body you can t foot give you can define the you can give the footer to the table you can uh, group the body content in the table you t head group the table header contain in the table you can give even the caption to the table for example table 1 table 2 table about person each and everything you can do with these things so this was all about for table thank you